What up folks, welcome to Ontario History Vlogs coming to you from guess where? That's right, Historic Ontario on Historic Euclid Avenue. 8.30 Sunday morning, I decided to come out here bright and early before it gets really, really hot. It's been crazy these past uh, few weeks, I would say. Coming to you from Holt and Euclid Avenue to share with you Ontario's oldest building at 132 years old, constructed in 1887 by an individual of the name Henry J. Rose and this building here was known as the Rose Block building uh, built in 1887. Did I say that already? If I didn't, I said it again. Anyways, uh, Mr. Rose was from Canada. He was a pharmacist and he moved here to Ontario and bought this land right here and opened up his pharmacy here. It was a little white building. It was a two-story building and he used that for two years until the great northern of 87 happened we know it today as santa ana winds but they had that back then as well and uh um, when that windstorm was happening it blew off the second story and it fell onto the vacant lot next to it and completely demolished the first floor his pharmacy but he noticed that the second story was still intact so he simply flipped it over and used that um for his pharmacy it became a single story little structure but then he only used that just for a little while because then he created this building right here in 1887. And in fact, Mr. Rose was George Chafee's brother-in-law. And very interesting story about this sign right here. It says Oliver Plows and Fittings. Back in 1913, two buildings were constructed here, one being the Fallows Building and the other one being the Independent Order of Odd Fellows. Well, fast forward to 2001, they had to demolish those buildings, unfortunately, for some reason. And uh, once they did that, guess what they discovered? the old Oliver plows and fitting signs. It looks like it's been touched up. However, that is not the case. It was wedged between two buildings for well over a hundred years. And uh, here it is today. Looks really, really nice. So I think it's pretty obvious to many, many people that this structure doesn't look the same like what it used to. But uh, this isn't no new restoration. This actually started happening in 1914. And come 1940, the current look that you see today was already established. Now the Rose Block building isn't this whole entire uh, building all the way to Holt Avenue. In fact, um, this uh, T-Mobile and the uh, Mexican restaurant right there was uh, built in 1891. Originally, it was just this structure right here, which is a little bit taller than the other two buildings that was uh, constructed in 1887. Hell of a long time ago. I tried to go inside some of these stores to show you the interior, but uh, some of these store owners aren't familiar with me so they didn't allow me to actually most of them didn't allow me to and the uh, restaurant right here uh, she said yes but then when I called the number and emailed her it was a fake number and a fake email so I don't know what's up with that here's the backside of Henry's building this is the alley that's Holt Avenue straight ahead Very interesting history over here in Ontario. Hope you all enjoyed this vlog. I'm gonna go home, feed my dogs, and eat me some breakfast. I'm Jerry James with Ontario History Vlogs, reminding you to live, learn, and to explore. Until the next time, see ya!